So I think we can all agree that we just want to see this fight, right? We, want, we all want to see Errol Spence and Terence Crawford go at it, fight for undisputed status at 147 pounds, the welterweight division for all the belts, for all the marbles, WBC, WBO, WBA, IBF, and Ring Magazine belts. We all, we all want to see this fight. We all want to see it. I'm, <laughs> I'm on social media almost every day. Uh, you know, looking at fans' reactions, uh, seeing, um, you know, keeping myself updated with the sport. And, um, you know, a lot of people bring up Crawford Spence. A lot of people bring it up because everybody's waiting for an official announcement for this fight. But it's looking like it's not going to happen or it's not, they haven't officially announced it yet. There, there have been talks. There are talks saying that it will happen possibly in November. Hence why this poster, it's a fan-made poster, by the way, it's not real. Uh, you know, poster says uh, November 19. Who knows, it might change. But, but yeah, everybody just want to see this fight. Everybody wants to see it. And who knows what's holding it up. To me, honestly, if this fight does not happen, if it does not happen, I'm going to blame Spence. I feel like Crawford has the one who's been making most of the effort to try to make this fight. Left top rank, no longer signed with a promoter, no longer, you can say, oh, he's on that other side of that street. You can't say that no more. And yet, the fight's not happening. Not only did he leave top rank, he's suing top rank for allegations of racism. So, you know, it, it's, uh, yeah, I don't know what the holdup is. Maybe it's money. It's always got to be money, right? Or maybe ego, or what have you. Maybe because from from what I've been reading, it looks like Crawford is willing to accept less money. That's what it looks like from what I've been reading. Crawford's willing to accept less money, and you know Crawford will be most likely be the B side, but there will be rematch clauses on both sides. Uh, either one, you know whether it's Spence or Crawford losing, they have the chance to activate a rematch clause from what I've read. Now, nothing has I've been officially been announced or posted or what have you, but, you know, in the end, we all just want to see this fight. No matter who is the A side or the B side, no matter who's getting more money or who's not getting more money, we just want to see this fight. As boxing fans, we want to see this fight. Um, I, now, I don't speak for everybody, but I think most of us actually would much rather see this fight. Most of us would much rather see Spence versus Crawford instead of seeing Spence fight Stan Yonis or Crawford fight Terman. Because that's another rumor floating around that if this fight does not happen, Spence will fight Stan Yonis and uh, Crawford will fight Keith Terman. Should be ridiculous if you ask me. But we'll see. But as of right now, late September at the time I'm making this video if this fight does not happen I'm gonna blame Spence <laughs> well I mean it seems to me that Crawford is more of the one who's willing to make this fight that's what it looks like to me so if I have to point a finger on who to blame for this fight not happening it's Spence in my opinion but that's just me anyway let me know what you guys think let me know your thoughts in the comments thanks for watching and like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.